day everybody it's your girl stephanie with stephanie is everything what you guys have to say no not really okay she'll have them to say so today guys i'm gonna be doing the 40 questions challenge and then challenging some folks to do this as well um, but first, before we get started, welcome, welcome. If you are new, please make sure that you subscribe to our channel because you never know what you're going to get. You never know if it's going to be a regular vlog where we're just talking, if it's going to be a challenge, or what's going to happen. So, please subscribe. Make sure you like the video and turn your notification bell on so that way you will be notified each and every time we upload a video. And also comment down below. Um, let us know how we're doing. Uh, just if you want to know something about us, comment down there. If you want to tell us how, we're, how our videos are or if you want us to do something, just let us know. We're open to pretty much anything right now. Um, so just, that's nasty, just let us know in the comment section, okay? So, to get this started, I am going to go ahead and get started with our questions. I'm reading the questions off. Okay. Apparently, she's reading the questions off. So, question number one, what do I got? Do you like blue cheese? No. <laughs> that is a very firm no. I tried it one time, and it tasted like mold. I can't. Mold? Mm -mm, I can't do it. How do you know what mold tastes like? I don't, but it just it just had like this nasty, mm -mm, and then a very nasty aftertaste. Ew. No blue cheese for me. That's a no. A big no. Mm -mm. Okay, the second question is, do you like Coke or Pepsi? Pepsi. You should have already known that one when you was writing that question, because, girl, I don't do Coke. I do not like Coke. It tastes too syrupy for me. I can't, I can't do it. Me? I like Pepsi. I prefer either one, but Pepsi is my most interest. I love Pepsi. Any kind of Pepsi. But it makes my teeth like dry and grindy and sweet. I like Pepsi. Okay, anyway. Next. The third question is, are you in a relationship? I am. She is engaged. I have been with my Mr. Mans for six years now. Six years, girl. About to be seven. We working on it. You're not old for it. Yeah, I'm not old. I'm not old though. I'm still young. You're in your thirties, so that's still young. It is still young. Okay. Next. You look like you're twenty. I don't thank you, baby. I'm far from twenty though. <laughs> <laughs> the fourth question is, do you like whiskey, tequila, or vodka? Um Whiskey, tequila, or vodka? It depends. Depends on which one. I have to have them mixed. Now, with whiskey, I like whiskey and Pepsi. With tequila, I like tequila sunrises. With tequila, the orange juice, and the grenadine. And with vodka, I like vodka and orange juice or vodka and cranberry. So, I mean, I'll drink all three. I can't drink none of them straight. <sighs> Because I just, I just, you will not see me the next day at all. I will be in my bed, bed bound with a bucket next to me. But, <laughs> yes, I like, I don't know, I drink all three. They just got to be mixed with something. I can't drink straight liquor. It's not my thing. Okay, the fifth, qu uh, yeah, fifth question is, do you like hot dogs or cheeseburgers? Mm. I'm a cheeseburger. I love cheeseburgers. Especially from McDonald's. Extra pickle, please. Ew, you're disgusting. No lettuce, no tomato, just straight, maybe mayonnaise, ketchup, mustard, and pickle. And I, cheese. I know the answer to the seventh question, but what's we're on the sixth. Okay, what's number six? The sixth one is, what is your favorite food? Chinese and Indian food. I love... Especially Mexican food. Chinese food. Oh, well, you know what? That is a really hard question because I don't really have, a, I mean, I can't pick between Mexican food, Chinese food, and Indian food because I love, love, love me some naan bread and some chicken tikka masala, which is Indian. And I like um, orange chicken, love orange chicken, um, Kung Pao chicken, and teriyaki chicken. chicken. 
And then for Every Mexican, chicken. I love me some tacos, some enchiladas, oh. and Mexican Mom, corn. stop. You're making me hungry. So. Ma. Yeah. Between those three. Those three are my favorite. Anyway. <laughs> the seventh one is, what do you drink in the morning? Uh, my answer, I would say Pepsi. For me? Yeah. Your answer for me would be Pepsi? Yeah. It's Pepsi. First oh, thing in the morning. That's what wakes me up. That's my coffee. I a good Pepsi. My me, daughter knows me. Me on the other hand, I used to drink. I still do. I drink coffee because <laughs> my grandma. <laughs> she drinks coffee. All my kids. Okay, y'all. My kids are four, eight, and ten. My mom has all three of my kids drinking oh. coffee. Coffee, I like y'all. The cookies. Cause she used to take them out to breakfast to IHOP. And the little <laughs> cups that you get for your um, creamer. creamer. My mama used to pour coffee in them little cups to make them feel special. So my I kids did. love coffee. I felt special. I don't even like coffee, but my kids love coffee. That's why we have like two. You have an espresso machine. We do have favorite. an espresso machine and my daughter wants to use it every five minutes. She Next. won't let me. No, I won't let you. You don't need all that coffee, girl. Next. Um... I don't know what the ninth one is, but the eighth one is, wait, are we in the eighth? Yes, we're on the eighth. Okay, the, that one is, can you do 100 push-ups? Hell no. <laughs> oh, sorry. Mom! No. <laughs> no, y'all, I can't do no 100 push-ups. We're gonna have Show to. me somebody who can do 100 push-ups. That's your fault. We're gonna Let me see a video out. of somebody who can do 100 push-ups. That's not me. Yeah. I can barely make it through maybe five. I think I might be able to do five. I can do like 20. You can do 20 push-ups? Up. Okay, we're going to do we're gonna do a video of what you're doing 20 push-ups. That if you can do no, I, I'm going to do... She said I'm she can no, do 20 push-ups, up. y'all. Sit-ups. No, they, this is push-ups, not sit-ups. No, I know, but I can, do do, like, I can do a lot of sit-ups. She said she can do 20 push-ups, y'all. I can't do no. I can do five. I can, I can do, do about five. I can do one push-up. That's just a one-second video. Okay. Just me. I can do about five. Anyway. We'll give it five. Ninth one is favorite season. Um, summer and spring because I don't like the cold. Well, autumn isn't, isn't it autumn? Autumn, fall. Autumn, yeah, autumn and fall. Like I mean, I don't mind. I like everything but wintertime. If there's no snow on the ground, I'm straight. <laughs> if the kids can go outside and play, I'm straight. I'm straight. So, I would say, yeah, I mean, I'm cool with autumn. But my absolute favorite, sorry y'all, my hair is a little crazy. My absolute favorite is going to be spring and summer because I like being on a beach somewhere and I like swimming. I love swimming. I love swimming and the beach. All of, all of us are water babies. Yes, everybody in my house is a water baby. We love, we love the water. That's why we have our huge pool. I just don't like lakes. I can't stand them. Anyway. Next. <laughs> ten, the tenth one is. Are you sure we're on number ten? Yes. Yeah, don't do that. You made me second guess. Okay, what's number 10, baby? <laughs> My fa uh, your favorite hobby. Mommy. Favorite hobby? Um, get out. Good day. Good day. <laughs> My favorite hobby? I don't know, cooking? Is that a hobby? They can be. Okay. <laughs> Um, I like cooking. The eleventh one is: Do you have tattoos? Girl, go on ahead with the fruit snacks. Go Bye. On. Yes, I have tattoos. I have one on each wrist. I've got three on my back, one on my leg, and one going down my side. So that's you do one, two, Which one is that? three. The moon? The floral is the one that goes down my side. Oh. And then I got the portrait of my dad, the butterfly, the butterfly, and then the moon and the stars. Isn't that like on your side or is that on your back? That's on my back. Oh. And then oh. on my leg, I have the man and the woman. The man, man and the woman. Man buttons. Yes. <laughs> man buttons. Okay, anyway. Um, so I, that's one, two, three, four. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven? Seven tattoos? Yeah. I think so. so. 
Anyway. I think that's the, all of them. <laughs> the 12th. No, I got your name right here. I have oh, eight. Oh, yeah. I forgot. I got Janaya right here. How could you forget me? I don't know. I'm trying to think of all my tattoos, bro. I got a lot. <laughs> that's pro I probably got some more, guys. I just can't think of it right now. My head's hurting. Anyway, the 12th one is the wear glasses. Yep. Is it fake? <laughs> no, nope, they're not fake. I really do have to wear glasses. She's going to poke me on eye for it. <laughs> I try to wear contacts, but my allergies get too bad because I am literally allergic to everything outside, every type of animal that you could possibly imagine. So it's really bad for contacts because Anything? my eyes are always itching, so okay, I can't really wear contacts. Okay, y'all. So I'm trying to convince her to get a hairless cat because then she can pet it and we won't get allergic to it. And she said no. No, because it's not going to matter. We got a dog. What, you want me to get a hairless dog? That's not a thing. Right. <laughs> but there's such thing as a hairless cat. I mean, I'll pet them, but I just have to make sure I take some medication before I do. I pet the, I pet the animals. I just have to make sure I take some allergy medicine. Well, Otherwise, I'll break out in hives. Them, kick them off your bed. You said, go. Yeah, because I haven't had no medicine, and I don't want them in my bed. Okay. I got to sleep in my bed, okay. whether I got medicine okay. or not. Okay, okay, whatever you say. No bed. I don't let okay. animals in my bed. I don't like it. It makes me itchy. You're itchy right now. I know. Thinking anyway, about it. Do you have any phobias? Um. Do I have any phobias? Well, like, what do you mean by phobias? Stuff that you're scared of. Spiders. The dark? <laughs> She's scared of the dark, y'all. She won't even go in the basement. And it's, it's a finished basement. It's not even a scary basement. I'm not going downstairs. Girl, myself. you got lights to the bottom of the stairs. You got lights as soon as you open up that door. Like, by every door is a light switch. Um, yeah. It's not that scary. I have it's to, not even scary, though. I yeah. have to have somebody right next to me or holding my hand while I go downstairs. Or I have to be distracted on my phone. I can't stand spiders uh, or bugs. That's why I don't use the bathroom downstairs with spider webs. Go use the bathroom downstairs. No. That's because the bathroom needs finished, though. Well, the bathroom's almost finished. The only thing we need to finish is the ceiling. <coughs> Everything else is finished down there. So there ain't no reason to be scared. Not so scared. Anyway, any other phobias? No, I'm just really scared of spiders. What? Isn't there... I know you do, Betty. Isn't we there will. another phobia where you have those, like, circles? It's something. It's like not... I think it's hives. That's not a phobia. Y yeah, some people... Are... They don't like it. Ooh. Right now. Anyway. Uh, nicknames. Steph. Stephanie. Stephanie's not a nickname. That's my name. Steph. Yes, I know, buddy. Go. That's all. It's just Steph. Go. Oh, I don't really have no. It used to be Shorty B. Or Snefney. <laughs> B used to call me Snefney. Snefney? Yep. Instead of a T, he used to call me with an N. Snefney. So it'd be Snefney. <laughs> Snefney. Mm -hmm. <laughs> anyway. I don't know um, why. I don't know how I even acquired that. Okay. Anyway. Favorite candy? I don't know this one. Kit Kat. Yeah. White chocolate. I love white chocolate. <laughs> Okay, I was about to spell it. White okay. chocolate Kit Kat, the just, cookies and cream Hershey bars. Or when they, um, I just tried this one a little bit ago. It was like the white Hershey almond. It's really yummy. You're disgusting. I love white chocolate. I hate white chocolate. I know you like dark chocolate. I love dark chocolate. <laughs> but yeah, mine would be the Kit Kat. I also like it because it's really healthy for, well, it's... Somewhat healthy for you? Yeah. <laughs> anyway. Okay. Biggest downfall. What does that mean? Biggest what? Downfall. It's true. It's on there. Biggest downfall? Uh huh. I don't know. What does that mean? I don't even know. What, I don't know. Okay, we're going to skip number 16 because I don't know. Biggest downfall. I will come up with a question for 16. Next. Anyway, 17. do you prefer rain or snow? Rain. Anything. 
rain all day. Let it rain, let it thunderstorm. Anything. I, you know what? I like rain because then it's like Hitting the soothing roof. and you can go to sleep. I sleep so good when it's raining. I and love it, the rain. Just, I, I just don't like thunder. I can deal with the rain. Oh, I love thunder. I like watching the lightning and the thunder, like You're looking out the crazy. window and watching it. Mm -mm. You're a psycho. I love it. I try to get in her bed. Mario scared. and Maya. I tried to get in her bed when it's thundering, and she said, "Get out my room." Yeah, cause you there's nothing to be scared of. You're in the house. No, but I'm scared. What if that tree falls? There's a tree right next to us. Girl. <laughs> yes. They're good. Anyway. Next. <laughs> I'm just waiting by. And do you have any piercings? Yes, I've got my cartilage right here, right here. Got two right here. Don't your lip. Got my lip. I've got my nose. Got, your belly got my button. belly button. I used to have an industrial. I had my eyebrow done, and really? I had my tongue pierced. Mm -hmm. yeah. I took my tongue out because I didn't like it. I took the eyebrow out because I didn't like it. Like that was when I was like what eighteen. I think yeah. I had my eyebrow done. It looks and the good industrial, on the industrial that I had, I had to take it out because it wasn't. I guess it wasn't pierced right or something. And then I just never got it redone. Oh, that's I wanted have, to. That's why you have that trunk piercing out of your right ear. here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it I'm, wasn't pierced right. I was wondering where, like, what? Because I had a bar. Is it that? Yeah, Miss Tiana has those. Or is it? Yeah, it is this one. I had a bar in my ear. Yeah, because you have a tongue missing in your ear. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's because they messed who, uh, the person that did my industrial bar when I got it done. I think I got that one done when I was like 18. Also, I'm really proud of you because all her nails, except for like one or two, are her actual nails. Yep, these are all mine. Look at mine. There's not I don't have any. one fake nail on this hand. These are all my nails. Except for that one that you broke. Except for this one, because I broke this one. But all all the other nine nails is all mine. Uh-huh. I don't have no fake nails, guys. It's all me. Anyway. Next. Do you believe in ghosts? Yes, I do believe in ghosts, and I do believe that there is another world. I think we're haunted. Why? Oh, it's just Maya. Because <laughs> I had my phone on the charger, and then all of a sudden it was underneath the uh, the couch. Was that you? No, I didn't touch your phone. I'm going to ask them after this video. Or we can just check the cameras. I am checking my camera. I can check the camera and see. Okay. You don't have to. I'll check it, and then I'll just make up a story if it moved on its own. <laughs> I'm just playing. I don't like, oh. No, we don't have no ghosts. But yes, I do believe in the supernatural and that there is a whole nother world. I do too. Anyways. I do, I do believe, your believe age. heavy in that. Women. What? Your age. I don't know. How old do you think I am? Well, I know your age for a fact. You're like 34. I'm 34. See, I told you she's not old. Not 35. That's old. Am I 34? Uh, yep. Yeah. I'm 34. Really? Yeah. Why would you ask that? Your birthday okay. was a couple months ago. Wait, a month ago. Anyway, uh, fries or onion rings? Mm. I don't know why there's an eight there. I don't either. <laughs> fries or onion rings? Onion rings. I don't know. I probably choose. It depends on where I get them from. Mm -hmm. Now, if I get the onion rings from the hospital... Them bad boys were huge, and they were yummy. But if you get onion rings from anywhere else, I really don't like them. So I would choose fries. <laughs> I'm like the only place that I will eat the onion rings from is the hospital, because when I worked at the hospital, them onion rings were huge. Oh my huge. goodness, they are so good. They're huge, and they're, they're delicious. I mm. wish you had that job back. That was so good. That's all right. And we got Sundays. Yeah. Ice cream? Like, I mean, we can still get food from up there. It's, everything's closed down because of quarantine. Fuck. They don't even have it open on them. I said fuck. Right now. Oops. <laughs> they don't even have it open right now. Anyway, how many kids? Maya, Mario. Shh. I got three kids and one stepson. Yeah. Three that are mine and one stepson. So four. Anyway, your favorite color? Purple. No dirt. Purple, y'all. Yeah. You see this purple? purple. Your hair is like a galaxy. My hair is purple and blue. 
purple. Hey, hey, stop running. 500 stop likes running before somebody like, gets hurt. 500 likes and she'll let me dye my hair back red. Janaya said if this video can get 500 likes, I'll let her dye her hair red. So, please, I'll let her dye her hair red if I get 500 really? likes on this video. Yep. <laughs> get oh 500 likes on this video. I'm begging you, please. My daughter said, please. So share this video out because my baby wants some, like, a, a red tint to her hair. And if I get 500 likes on this video, I'll let her do it. Next. If this doesn't, I'm going to be sad. Anyways, the 25th one is, ooh, can you sing? No, I can't hold a tune for the life of me. But I can. I cannot. But I am camera shy, so you probably got to get over that camera shy. I can. Yes, you can. No, I can. Next. Only thing I see is from my family. Anyway, can you whistle? Yep, I can whistle. A little bit. <laughs> when were you born? When? August 16th, 1986. Oh, that was where. I think. <laughs> where were you born? It was yeah. where, not when. Yeah. Lord, she can't even read. Yeah, I'm yeah. Okay. Here in Fort Wayne. Boring Indiana. Boo. I know. No more fun. I wish I was born in California. I love California. Can we move there? No. Can we move to Disneyland? I want to go to South Carolina or North Carolina. Can we move to Disneyland? We can move where it would be closer to get to Disneyland. Because if we move to South Carolina Ooh. or North Carolina, then we'll be close to a Disney, whichever one is in Florida. Really? Yeah. Yes. If we move there, they're not that far. Okay, the other one is how many siblings? I have two. I have two older sisters. I'm the baby. <laughs> I don't know. Um, can you cook? No, there you are. Can mom. I cook? <laughs> can I cook? Yeah, you just grilled yesterday, plus you cooked us food today. I can cook, yeah. I know what I'm doing around the kitchen. Plus, we tried to make a video of a morning <laughs> we were cooking pork chops. No. Pork steaks. Cube steaks. Cube steaks. Yeah. We were making cube steaks, mashed potatoes, gravy. They were so good. And something else. I don't remember Corn. what else we were making that day. I think. I don't remember. But yeah, kids didn't cooperate in the filming of that video, so it never got posted. Can you swim? No. I know how to swim. Last time I asked you, you said no. I know how to swim. So you're trying to lie? Maybe. I do know how to swim. Our pool is just not big enough to really go that far in the... MJ does it? <laughs> I always got to carry a kid. Mine's always want me to walk her around the pool. I can't swim with a kid in my arm. Okay. But yes, I know how to swim, y'all. 30. We're on 30 now? Yeah, I can't read that huge word. Are you religious? Religious. Right. A little bit. Well, not a little bit, like halfway. We go to church almost every Sunday with Grandma. My religious? We, not you. You have to go to work. We go to Grandma's. I believe in a higher power. But... but I just ain't found a church that fits me, y'all. I had a church, and then the pastor got sick and retired. And I just haven't found a church that really connect that I connected with um, since him. That was Scott. He died? No, I said he got oh. sick. He had heart issues, and he had to have multiple surgeries. And then he just went ahead and retired. So, now, I haven't really found a church since then. Like, that was, like, a real, like, family, family type church. Like, you felt part of it. That's and, like, how you knew him? Mm -hmm. And he was my pastor. After and that. And my taekwondo instructor. He was mine, too. Yeah, that's why I took you over there. How do you think I knew it? Can I you do that? Hey, y'all, yeah. cut it. Cut it out, Demario. Yeah. Cut it yeah. out. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Shout yeah. your back. He was my pastor and my taekwondo instructor. Showers or bath? Uh, showers. I don't really like a bath. When you're 
Only when you're like relaxing. When I'm relaxing and I don't have no kids and I can light some candles and give me a little sip sipping. I sit in the tub in a nice bubble bath and soak. But if you need to like take a bath like really bad to the point where you have dirt. Like, I would not do that. I'm about to take a shower. Because when you take a bath, you're sitting, you're sitting in, in your dirt. Yeah. That's why I don't like baths. It's not that I'm saying that I'm dirty. I just don't like sitting. In, I don't know. I don't like sitting in the tub. I even, I clean it out after. Like, I clean it out every time. I can't. I can't even when I'm getting in the shower. I do. I have to clean the tub out because I can't. I have to have. I wash on the walls underneath the bath mat. Like, yeah, I, I have to clean. I have to clean out the tub, whether I'm taking a shower or a bath. Why do I sound time. like you? Because you're me, child. Anyway. Next. Do you like big city or nature? She hates camping. Yeah, I choose big city all day, every day. That's where she gets her <laughs> Wi-Fi. No, I just I don't like. Okay, if it's I can do nature. If it's not nighttime, because I don't do bugs and I hate mosquitoes. I hate mosquitoes. So if it's during the day, I can do nature. I really can. And I would prefer that during the day over a big city. But then you got to have the big city for the nightlife because then you can go out and do stuff and get out and have some fun. You know? Not really, but okay. Um... I'll are you it. are you a good friend? Yes. Yeah. I'm a good friend. She's nice, kind, listening. I'm Let's always a listening here. So if anybody ever needs somebody to talk to, then they know my phone line is always open. I don't have, like, I don't care what time of day it is. Like, I'm that friend that if you need me at 2, 3 o'clock in the morning, <laughs> you call my phone and I'm hopping up. Now, if it's a search and rescue at 2, 3 o'clock in the morning, I'm coming ready. But if I ask you to do something, you ain't coming and you ain't ready. No. Because yours is not as important as some of the calls that I will get at 2, 3 o'clock in the morning from a friend of mine. Because yours is, Mom, I need, a, I need a remote. You don't feel like getting up and getting the remote. No, I'm scared of the dark. That, she going to have to get over that. I can't. Next. Then I asked you to make me a bowl of cereal and you said, no, go get your own cereal. She knows how to make a bowl of cereal. This girl about to yeah, be 11 years old. Scared. And she knows how to turn on the light switch too. So, like I said, when it's important it was like and they three. absolutely ASAP, like right now, right now need me, yes, I am jumping up out of my bed and I will be there in some gym <laughs> shoes and some sweats and I'm, I'm coming up. I did need you. I was starving. I've had people call me at like 3 o'clock in the morning like, hey. Okay, let's go. You. Let's go. I was pregnant one time. Mm -hmm. I can't remember who I was pregnant with. I think I was pregnant with... I actually think I was pregnant with you when I had a friend of mine who called me. And she was at the club. And I had to pop up at the club. Pregnant. <laughs> and got my friend and saved my friends. You wouldn't have done that for me. Why wouldn't I have done that for you? Girl, please. You can't make me a bowl of cereal. <laughs> I'm not making her no bowl of cereal. Next you question. Have broken bones. Yes. I have broken, y'all. Don't laugh. But I have broken both of my wrists twice. The first time I was in fifth grade and I was a tomboy and my mama put me in this dress in wintertime, Lord knows why, with these dress shoes on and some dang on little pantyhose and I wanted to play kickball and um, so I played kickball and there was a patch of ice on base. I made it to base though. <laughs> so they didn't get me out but I slipped and I landed wrong on my wrist and I was in the cast after that and then I was playing around again and I broke that wrist while it was in a cast and then right after I got out of that cast I broke my other wrist How? at the roller dome there was it was all night skating back when all night skating was a thing and <laughs> i got pushed down by an adult 
which my mama was hot about, but I got pushed down as an adult or by an adult and um they ran over my wrist and broke my wrist but they also fell so that's what they get <laughs> so not only did they break my wrist but they also hurt themselves because they ended up running me over with their skate and fell right after me so they should have just went around me instead of pushing us down because it was me and another friend of mine she didn't break anything but i did i broke my you wrist you would have if that happened to me, you would have been heated. I I'd have like, probably went up there and hurt somebody, but <laughs> my mom is not violent. No. I can't say very, the same. She's a very calm soul. Yeah, she's a little calmer than me. That's what I like about Grandma. Why? Because she's calm? Yes. What are you trying to say? I don't play when it comes to my kids, y'all. You're too hot-headed. I don't play when it comes to my kids, y'all. I will pop off when it comes to my kids. One day I told her that somebody, I was joking, and I said, somebody made fun of me. She said, how old are they? I said.